Uh, hey, uh, hey, Vince, how you doing? I'm doing all right. Well, that's great. That's great. That's great. So, uh, WrestleMania is uh, around the corner. Mm -hmm. About two months. So, uh, what do you got for me? Okay. Uh, well, Brandon and I, and I'm sorry, Brandon couldn't be here. Uh, Brandon and I uh, have uh, compiled a list here of matches that we think that were going to be very exciting. Uh, we think you're going to love them. We think the fans are definitely going to love them. Uh, I almost see you getting a million more subscribers to the WWE Network. Um, we're very sure of this. I've already I've already went through this list with uh, Stephanie and Hunter, and uh, they wanted me to run it by you for final approval. And um, here's what we got so far. Uh, for the Divas uh, Championship, we're doing um, Charlotte versus uh, Sasha Banks. Mm -hmm. For the... Uh, Tag team titles, we're doing uh, The New Day uh, versus the Dudley Boys. Uh, we're doing, um, we're also going to do uh, Reigns versus Dean Ambrose, since uh, Ambrose has finally turned heel. We're also going to do an Intercontinental uh, Championship match uh, with uh, Owens versus Sami Zayn. Uh, we're going to do the Dream Match, finally, The Undertaker versus Sting. Uh, we're going to get rid of the, uh, the Andre the Giant Memorial Battle Royal match, and we're going to bring back the Money in the Bank match. We're going to have AJ Styles versus Kalisto versus Dolph Ziggler versus Neville, preferably without a cape, uh, Tyler Breeze, and with a surprise main roster debut of Finn Balor. And uh, we're going to top it all off with... Um, with the WWE Championship on the line, Triple H versus Brock Lesnar. Uh, <clears throat> what do you think, boss? Well, I think that sucks. What? I think it sucks. Uh. uh oh. Okay, Vince. Uh. Well. Oh. What would you want to do? Uh, okay, uh, what else you got? Alright, for my next match, I'll have a David versus Goliath match. Okay. You'll have Hornswoggle in one corner, and you'll have the Big Show on the other. Okay. If Hornswoggle wins, the Big Show has to block James from Twitter. Okay, okay. And if the Big Show wins, Hornswoggle will probably be dead. Okay, so everybody wins on that one. Okay, I, I'm still not too sure about that, Vince. What, what else you got? Alright. And for my next match, it's going to be Mick Foley versus Mankind. <laughs> uh, 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 okay, um, you, you do know that Mick Foley is Mankind, right? Dwayne Johnson is the Rock. That that's that, that's his real name, Dwayne Johnson. No, it's not. Yes, it is. Dwayne Johnson is the Rock. Uh, why don't you know this yet? Hey, wait a minute. The Fast and Furious guy is the Rock. Yes. The Tooth Fairy is the Rock. Yes. No. Yes. What? Coke versus Pepsi. What what else you got? Zombie match. No. Zombie triple threat. No. Damn it. Undertaker versus your son. I don't have a son. Undertaker versus my son. No, really, nobody would really want to see that. That makes no sense. Okay, got it. 
Undertaker versus the Sun. Batman versus Superman. This is it. You're just getting stupid now. Fake Diesel versus Real Diesel. You you mean uh, Kevin Nash versus Kane? Uh, uh, no, that that wasn't him. That's Fake Diesel. Yeah, uh, yeah, whatever, man. I, I don't know anymore. Okay, okay. One more match. Here we go. You'll love it. And the main event of WrestleMania 32. Roman Reigns versus Triple H. Out, out of all the things you've mentioned, this is this is the best match, but really nobody nobody likes Roman Reigns. I'm sure i I think Roman Reigns' mom doesn't like Roman Reigns. Well that's gonna happen, damn it. <sighs> well, whatever. Well that's my WrestleMania thirty two card, whether you like it or not. So here's your compensation. I hope you enjoy it. Oh. Wrestle crate. Alright, uh, well, well, uh, thanks, Vince. Um, WrestleMania's gonna suck. Wrestle crate review. Hey there, WrestleManiacs. It's your old pal James Wooten along with Brandon. Hey, we are here with March's Wrestle Crate. That's right. We got the ultimate crate, of course, as always. Uh, uh, we are, what, two days away? This many? One, two. Two days away from the show of shows, WrestleMania 32. Uh, who do you want to win, Brandon, Triple H, or Roman Reigns? Triple H. Good man, good man. All right, did a lot of cool uh, events on the card, um, but uh, like I said previously in the, in the skit, uh, WrestleMania this year is going to suck. Not a lot of matches I'm really looking forward to. Um, but uh, yeah, first things first, we're going to get it out of the way. Uh, if you go, if this is your first time, uh, uh, sorry, if you are watching this video and you are persuaded by my boyish good looks and the awesomeness that is contained inside this awesome brown box that you want to subscribe to WrestleCrate, please go to their website. We will provide a special link all the way down here at the bottom in the description. Uh, go, to, uh, go to that link and then um, you're going to type in the code Oh, what is it? JW sent me, and you're going to get 10% off your first subscription. Just in case you don't know how to read or you don't know how to read quick, here it is again. JW sent me, and we're going to get this, wrap it all up, and put it up there in the corner of the screen there for a little bit. Um, also, uh, if you, like I said, go to that special URL that we're going to put down there. That benefits me in the long run. We would greatly greatly appreciate it. Now there are two versions of the, the Wrestle Crate. There is a standard crate that is $14.99 plus shipping and handling. Then there is this, the Ultimate Wrestle Crate. Extra stuff for $15 more for $29.99 plus shipping and handling. All right, with that being said, I believe I covered just about everything, Brandon. Did I miss anything? I think you got it all. We've been doing this for a while. Hopefully I don't know how to miss Hopefully I don't miss anything. Mm -hmm. So uh, we'll get it out here. Got my jib. We're going to start blading. All righty, let's see. Uh, as far as I know, I only know of one thing they've hinted to this month, and that is uh, elite figures from several different waves. I know which one I want because I looked up the waves. If I get it, we'll see. It could be another Luke Harper or Adam Rose for this guy. I don't know. All right, as always, I'm going to open it towards the camera. I don't want to. I don't want to spoil anything for myself. Brandon, quit peeking. Quit peeking. All righty. Fill, fill a shirt. Fill something in a plastic package. Let's go for it. We got... <laughs> we got a Steve Weiser uh, <laughs> bottle cap opener. That is awesome. This is heavy too, Brandon. Feel how heavy that is. Oh wow, that's pretty yeah, good. That's pretty good I'm material surprised there. surprised got that's through the mail. Yeah. But yeah, this is... I don't know... I don't know where I'm going to keep this, but I do have a Steve Weiser bottle opener. That is pretty cool. Pretty cool old Steve Weiser there. Oh, hell yeah. All right, we got a... Uh, okay. Let me take this out. What we got here? 
Ring of Honor Wrestling Tag Team Turmoil 2011. Uh, another awesome DVD to add to my slowly growing Ring of Honor collection. Uh, American Wolves, oh well. Uh, and uh, versus Roderick Strong and Michael Elgin, I guess that's how you pronounce it. Don't really watch a lot of uh, Ring of Honor. Uh, Shelton Benjamin and Charlie Haas, awesome. World's Greatest Tag Team. Versus El Generico and Colt Cabana. We all know who El Generico is, right, Brandon? Sammy. Sammy, Sammy, that's right. Uh, special challenge match, Kenny King versus Mike Bennett. Awesome, I love Kenny King. <laughs> Uh, Ring of Honor Contenders Tag Team Lottery Tournament. Uh, Jay and Mark Briscoe versus the Bravado Brothers. Uh, we got Adam Cole on here. Uh, you know, Baby Richards and stuff like that too. So awesome DVD. Like I said, to add to my slowly growing Ring of Honor collection. Thanks, guys. Awesome, awesome, awesome. I love getting my DVDs. I love them. All right. There's a figure. There's a shirt. There's. I'm not looking. I'm not looking. I know what it is. Is it stupid? I'm gonna hate it. I don't know. Is it another Bella? I don't know. <laughs> all right, we got another something. Hey, all right. Wow, this is actually pretty neat. Check this out. It's a WrestleCrate exclusive. We got the shirt of this guy last month. This is Kenny Omega, and we got one of these awesome, looks like another Calling Spots type of uh, print here signed by the man himself, Kenny Omega. He's the current leader of the Bullet Club. That's actually pretty neat. Uh, pretty, I love getting these autographs. These are these are really fun to get every month. Um, like I said, you're probably going to be standing in line for, uh, for about 30, 20 minutes to 30 minutes and then pay 30, 40 bucks for a signature, whereas you don't have to do any of that. You just pay your 30 bucks here, no waiting in line. You just have to wait for it to get in the mail. It's awesome. Another awesome autograph to add to the collection. Kenny Omega. Oh, almost getting. Yeah, what is this? Oh, it's like a sticker. Oh, sticker brand. What is it? Who in the hell is that? Is that real? Really? Is that psychosis? Is that psychosis, Brandon? Mm -hmm. I hope. Looks I'll, like him. I hope. And correct me if I'm wrong, folks. You guys always do if I screw up some wrestler's name, but, you know, that looks like, you know. That looks like a psychosis to me. I don't know. So if I'm wrong, please let me know. But uh, I always like these little cool little things there. I always like to be uh, schooled. And, uh, you know, you can add to my professional wrestling uh, library up here. That's awesome. But, uh, Sports entertainment. Oh, so, no. <laughs> Sorry, Vince. All righty. I believe that is it. All right. So should we go with figure or T-shirt first? Brandon, I'll let you decide, sir. Figure. Figure, Brandon. I'm, not, I'm gonna hate this, aren't I? I mean, I'm gonna love it because of what I paid for, but here we go. Hey, that's not bad. Psycho said, God, this is brand new, too. Mm -hmm. This is a brand new figure. Wow. I, I don't hate this at all. That's pretty cool. Psycho said, I mean, I would have preferred to have had Dolph Ziggler back there. Cause that's the that's the newest Dolph Ziggler figure that I want, but I mean you can't go wrong with Psycho Sid. I mean he was a WWF champion. I mean, like I said, you, you, you can't go wrong with that. That's, that's really cool. I, I love getting these elite figures because it makes the box to me so much more worth it. I mean it's a twenty dollar action figure. You're paying thirty dollars for this box, plus you get all the extra stuff. So I I love that. I love that. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. All right. Here we go. I think I spoiled the t-shirt for myself on a Funko, WWE Funko Pop play, uh, page on Facebook, and I really didn't want to spoil that for myself, but I ended up doing it. All right. Here we go. Take that out. Yep. Box is done. Here we go. I did spoil it for myself, but I love it. I love it so much. I'm sorry. I love you. <laughs> I love, love this shirt. I'm going to wear this shirt Sunday for WrestleMania. I love it, folks. I love that shirt. I love this shirt even more because I was there when this match happened. I was actually in Orlando at the Citrus Bowl for WrestleMania 24. That's awesome. I love, I love this shirt so much. 
Oh, that's 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 so crazy. I love it. I'm sorry. I love you. That's what I that's what I say. That's what I say to everybody that I'd say I love that I love to. I just kick them in the face. You know, switching music all the time. All right, that. I love I love that shirt. I don't man. I don't know. This might be my favorite shirt. I, I really like it's the dark. Mine. I really like the Darth Vader Hill shirt. Um, man, it, it's gonna be hard to top that. All right. Let's get everything assembled here. Wrestle Crate Assemble! Oh, and by the way, if you didn't notice behind me, I have WrestleMania shirts and hats. Those are all the ones that I got from attending various uh, WrestleMania events. Because I'm like super cool. Alright, we got your. Got your bat. Got your bat. Got your oh hell yeah, Steve Weiser. Think that upside down. Mm -mm. Right there. Right there. See, it. see that, Brandon? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Can't see it at all. All I see is you. Me. Down. Down, down goes the shirt. Uh, over some. Ah, well, that's the best you really can do anyway. And that is. It just says, I love you, is all I can see. And Shawn Michaels kicking someone. There you go. I'm sorry, I love you. <laughs> you see that? <laughs> that's okay. Is it alright? Your face is not shown, but. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. There it is. Yay. I got all that full, cool stuff that we got this month. I'm fine. I'm fine with all that. All right, so uh, there's that. Um, I'm gonna. I got a, got a special announcement um, here in a second. Uh, but first of all, I want you to um, I want you to make sure you subs visit and subscribe to Brandon's page uh, right here. I want you to subscribe to my page right here. Um, so do that for us but uh, our special announcement is that next month will be our last wrestle crate unboxing um it's been a year since i've since i found out about the product and uh since I, i've been a subscriber since day one since launch and uh i figure years uh good to go it has nothing to do with the product it just has to do with you know you know i mean I, you know, I got, you know, I'm most like everybody, everybody's got student loans. So, you know, $30 extra a month will help this boy out. But, uh, yeah, this is, this is going to be, uh, the ne next month will be our last unboxing. I'm hoping to go out with a bang. I've already, uh, I've had an idea since, I think, October I told Brandon about that I'm wanting to do. And, uh, I'm hopefully we'll be able to, uh, hopefully we'll be able to do it. And we'll probably mix some uh, best of moments from a from a year's worth of wrestle creating there also. But make sure you definitely check out next month's uh, year of wrestle crate video and our final unboxing. Um, but other than that, uh, hope you enjoy WrestleMania, and I hope you enjoy NXT Takeover Dallas tonight. But uh, with that being said. See you later, and that's the bottom line because the whoop and said so. We'll catch you later. See you, Brandon. See ya. Peace.